Well, Rutgers football concluding its spring season with the scarlet white scrimmage Thursday night, and it featured one of the best touchdowns in Rutgers history. News 12's Robin Dean explains. Scarlet Knights are being joined by several healthcare professionals. The clock may have expired in the Rutgers spring scrimmage, but there was time for one more play. To have that last play and then to have all the players jump all over, that was really special to me because those guys, they, everybody on that play really spent a ton of time working on our players, helping our players, arranging for our players to be cared for. It was the perfect way to honor the healthcare heroes at RWJ Barnabas Health that ensured student athlete safety during the pandemic and took care of the team through several COVID pauses. It really was uh, unparalleled, I think, you know, in, in, I know in my career, my 33 years, unparalleled as far as the amount of strain and stress that it put on everybody involved and those people probably the most right testing every day dealing with dealing with the guys that were positive. Thanks to a collective effort, Rutgers was one of two Big Ten teams to play all nine scheduled games in 2020. A real heartfelt thank you to them and I know we're not done yet. It's, we're not out of the woods, but uh, I was really, really appreciative. The Scarlet White game caps a spring season consisting of 15 practices. Head coach Greg Schiano says he was happy with how his guys competed. I like our team. I think they work really hard. I thought that they approached this thing like a mature group of guys. We have some good leaders that, that run the team, and that's important. I'm Robin Dean for News 12 Sports. Oh, wow. Good on Coach Schiano. Wasn't that a cool moment, really, for the entire Rutgers football program. The team opens up its 2021 season September 4th against Temple. So go are you.